Okay, so again, we're going to do an MCQ style exam question, but because of the calculations involved, I'm doing it on Excel so that it's easier to follow. Obviously, in the real exam, you'll be using the calculator to perform these calculations. So the question is, given that the first unit took a time of 100 hours, the learning rate is 75%, find average time for the first nine units, total time for the first nine units, time taken for the ninth unit. Again, the exam question won't be so straightforward in the requirement all the time. It will be close, but again, you need to know all these calculations for the exam. So let's start. So average time for the first nine units, Again, that's based on the formula y is equal to ax raised to power b. So a in this case is 100 hours times x, the number of units, 9 raised to power b, which is log of the learning rate, in this case 0.75, divided by log of 2, right, always log of 2. So that gives us our formula. The average time taken for the first 9 units was 40.17 hours. After that, we have the total time for the first nine units. We simply multiply the average time by nine. And the incremental time, for that, we need to calculate the average and total time for eight units as well. So this was for nine units, right? Now we need to do the same calculation for eight units. What we can do is, we can simply go for the total time calculation for eight units by putting the formula straight off. So, will be the number of units, A, into the formula of Y is equal to AX raised to power B. A is 100 into 8 raised to power, again, log of 0 0.75 divided by log of 2. If you're wondering why I'm not using simple copy paste of the formula above, I figured it's better to just go through the formula again so that it's easier to follow, right? Okay, so that'll give us a total time for 8 units at 337.5. So the incremental time for the ninth unit will be 361.57, the total time for 9 units, minus 337.5, the time taken for 8 units. So 24.073 approximately, okay? And this calculation needs to be on your fingertips. Immediate cal easy calculations to do, average time, total time, incremental time for a particular unit so that you can do this quickly in the exam.